everyone. So I put up a picture in my Instagram stories a couple weeks ago when we were traveling down to Kampala and I got a lot of questions about why we needed to have all of this stuff checked, why we had to worry about worms, why did we go to Kampala, all of this stuff. So um, I'm assembling our video right now about our entire trip to Kampala, but I wanted to just do a quick uh, breakout just to talk about this because I think it's uh, a big question that everyone asks and you know it's something that we deal with regularly is health, hygiene, um, dealing with worms, uh, not having clean drinking water, not having people that know about safe hygiene. So here's kind of a breakdown of what we do with our family and how we keep everybody healthy. So we have to go down to Kampala. Mm -hmm. Once every quarter, once every six months, we always go for the doctor. There are not that many reliable doctor resources where we are in Gulu. There's some, but not not many. So um, yeah, so we go down to the capital to actually we <laughs> we go to get usually um, to the dentist because mm -hmm. there's not any reliable dentists up here, um, and we also go to get our exit exams is what it's kindly called. Uh, they check our poop and our pee for worms. So... Worms, amoebas, yeah, yeast. All the things. So we do that on a quarterly basis. We're gonna see if we can extend it to every six months or mm -hmm. see if we can find a better lab up here. But um, We would rather screen for it than preemptively take the... Yes. The medicine. Yeah, we went down to, to the place called the surgery this time and they have, um, we got, we all got our poop checked. It took two half days of waiting for everyone to, you know, poop on, can't make, you can't make anyone poop on command. I dare you to try that. Um, so we had to wait for all of those and then yeah. getting our kids to toddlers to pee in a cup so they could all go get it checked. Yeah. Two of us have amoebas this time, mm -hmm. which is pretty normal for at least one of us to have an amoeba or yeah. something. Um, and that's really just because hygiene is kind of a new concept, like hand washing with soap. How to adequately wash your hands before preparing food or after going to the bathroom. Uh, so those are... It's new. It's new to Gulu and most of Uganda, so... We can't guarantee that, so then, you know, things, things travel <laughs> around. Yeah. So we get everybody checked, so just to make sure that nobody's got any yeah. worms. I don't want worms. They're so. gross. So thanks for watching. I hope that was helpful in kind of explaining a little bit about our lives and some of the things we have to deal with. Are there other countries that have to deal with this kind of stuff? We don't know. We just know what it's like in Uganda. So comment, uh, send us a message. We'd love to hear from you. Um, thanks for watching and we'll see you next time.